What's up, Knights? I'm Chelsea, one of your UCF social media ambassadors. I'm going into my senior year and I'm studying journalism. Today, I'm just gonna show you what a day in the life looks like as a journalism major. Let's get started. So I'm back from my morning drive with my dog, Emma. I'm sitting on the floor outside on the patio because that's where I feel most comfortable. I kind of shift around throughout the day just to have a change of scenery. I'm gonna go ahead and get started on some coursework specifically for Mass Comm Law. I have a couple quizzes and a test, so definitely need to get studying. And it's also one of the required courses for journalism majors. So I'm gonna go do that. As I mentioned previously, I am a journalism major, so I'm currently working on a profile story about a UCF student. It's very important that you work diligently at getting stories and nailing them because in the journalism program, you have a portfolio that has to be submitted prior to graduation and it has to be approved for you to graduate. It's given me probably some of the best experience I'll get in college at doing field work and being invested in that and what it truly means to be a reporter. That's why I always keep my handy dandy reporter's notepad with me at all times because as most of my professors say, news is 24 seven, it can happen anywhere, anytime. Don't doubt it, breaking news, always gotta be prepared for it. I will say that during this time, it has been such a learning curve because all I've known is reporting on campus or covering events off campus that are relating to UCF and physically being there, but you don't get that same emotion and tone when interviewing people while doing everything online. So I am so thankful for Nicholson for providing just the utmost support from all of our professors and faculty there and being very communicative with us during this time, as well as UCF for providing resources such as the Writing Center, because without those, I honestly think I would be lost without those resources and those professors and faculty. chapters, wrote more notes and studied for a couple of hours, but I'm going to go ahead and take a break because I cannot focus for that long. I'm actually going to go ahead and drop off a cute little letter, here it is, that I wrote to one of my best friends. She's like family to me. I love her family and she's been feeling super discouraged lately and it's really important to just stay connected during this time, especially when you can't see those closest to you. So I brought my gloves and I'm going to go ahead and drop that off for her. She lives right down the road, so it's not too far. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please be sure to subscribe, like, share, and comment. And if you wanna see more about the organizations I'm a part of, as well as student life here at UCF, go ahead and give me a follow on Instagram. Remember, keep charging on, stay safe, and stay healthy nights.